And here we are back in your living room, fans, with another fantastic international feud this time between a man down from down under, that Don Kent, against Victor Jovica from Yugoslavia. That's right, Yugoslavia living in Puerto Rico. Boy, he's really batting zero for three, isn't he? <laughs> and then you've got the international El Vikingo from El Salvador. No, well, he's from close to Puerto Rico. He come over on one of those Dominican boats, man. I'll be sure and tell him that personally. I tell him every time I see him, man. He knows what I think of him, brother. <laughs> Believe me. <laughs> and what do you think of Jovica? Uh, Jovica, I already told you, man. He's batting zero for three. <laughs> number one, Czechoslovakia. Number two, living in Puerto Rico. Gee, man. You can't get any lower than that, brother. And what do you think of Don Kent? Don Kent's a fantastic guy. My roommate, El Kangaroo, one of the greatest tag teams in the world at one time with a fabulous kangaroo. And guess who they were? Don Kent. Don Kent and Al Costello, one of the greatest old-timers of all time. Well, right now, a lot of veteranship, you can call it that, a lot of experience in that ring. Oh, yeah, you know, I'd say all three of those guys' age totals up there in the hundreds, brother. Oh, my. Side headlock by Victor Jovica in control now. One thing about Don Kent, you know, he's a thinking man's wrestler. He's always thinking about what he's going to do, how he's going to do it. Now, like... Jovica here's got a headlock on him, but that's not phasing Don Kent. See, Don Kent's thinking three or four moves ahead. Oh, now, I don't think that's Don Kent was planning that move that, out. I think that, that, that's using your head, Bobby. That got his attention, yeah. And back to the side headlock. Hey, Jovica is a size advantage in this match. Well, Jovica, you know, he had that serious back operation. Yes. And after he had that serious back operation, you know, they wouldn't let him gain a lot of weight back because that puts pressure on your back. But Jovica is definitely the taller man and the thicker man. Let's put it oh, that but way. But, he, but he Don has, Kent is definitely the aggressor. But Jovica hasn't missed many meals, though. Oh, no. I'm just saying, jo Jovica is thinner now than he has been in the past because of that back operation. I think Jovica is staying in better shape now than he did before. Well, if you say so, Bobby. If I say so, you know darn well it's true. Yeah. Side headlock by Jovica. And Don Kent right now. Trying to get to his feet. Oh, we got there. Rude awakening. That, that was an illegal move, as you saw there. He saw a very illegal move. It's a little rabbit punch. That's not a rabbit punch. It's a right to the jaw, man. That's not a rabbit punch. Well, see, Victor Jovica's the lefty, so it doesn't count. No, oh, okay, it doesn't count. Yeah, that's, you know, that's, that's your way of keeping score in professional wrestling, right? Well, let me tell you something. Don Kent, man, there's a rough and tough character. You watch front face lock right there in a the turnbuckle. And one feature of this match is that these men have battled many times. And therefore, they have a history. And I'll tell you, both of these men would like to get the W in the column. Well, they've never had really a clear cut uh, victory in, in this feud like you say that they've had going around Puerto Rico. There's never been a clear cut victory. There's always been a few little errors here, errors there, if you know what I mean. And I know Don Kent wants to get it off his mind. He wants to, you know, one time, one time for all, just beat Jovica right in the middle of the ring, one, two, three. And I'm sure Jovica wants to do the same to him, which will never happen, Jovica. <laughs> a little bit of international bragging rights right here. And so far, Jovica off the ropes now, shoulder blocked. But you got to admit one thing, Don Kent really hasn't... Oh, look has at it, that. ...hasn't mounted an offense here. He's been a defensive wrestler up to now. Absolutely, the offensive belongs completely to Victor Javica. Yeah, but see, sometimes you can lull an opponent to sleep by letting him get overconfident in the match, too. Maybe that's what Don Kent's doing. Do you ever think of that, Rick St. James? Are you saying he'd sort of start off slow and come on strong? That's right, baby. That's possible. Let's see. Well, you give a guy like Javica a little bit of confidence, you know, he has, he's not too much of a confident guy anyhow, you know. Javica? No, yeah, that's true. So if you give him a little confidence, then maybe he'll make that fatal mistake. <laughs> I don't know. He's the kind of guy you got to park your car by if you want to see him, you know what I mean? We've... what? We've seen many a win from Javica right here on Caribbean Championship Wrestling. No, that's just one match that we played over and over. Oh, please. Tommy, mind your manners. This is holiday. Oh, yeah. Hey, Happy New Year! <laughs> I can't wait for that day. That's my favorite holiday. Well, and the Five Kings Day, man, that's great, too. It's Three Kings. Ah! It's what? Never mind. It's what? Jovica maintains the advantage right now. Looks like he's complaining to the referee. That his trunks were grabbed. No, his trunks weren't grabbed. Here goes Don. Oh, right there. He had a whole handful of Don Ken's hair. You saw it, I saw it, and the wrestling fans in Carolina saw it. 
I don't know, Duncan. The only person on this island that didn't see it is El Dumbo, El Reparillo, El Vikino. I could just tell, Bobby. I don't think Don Ken has that much hair to grab. I tell you, I saw it, man. What do you think I'm doing? There's a nice knee. Nice, good knee. Knee left by Don Ken. Turns it in his favor now. Now he's showing a little uh, offensive here by the Aussie. Don Kent pounding on the chest of Javika. He's getting a count from uh, Vikingo, but right now, Don Kent knows perfectly how to handle the ropes and everything else. That's right. Don Kent knows his way around that wrestling ring, brother. He uses it like a second home, as you can see, brother. And you tell, even those people in ringside Carolina are amazed at the strength and the, the ferocity of Don Kent. El Kangaroo. Ah. Well, right now, he's demonstrating that fact with Victor Javika pounding on him. I tell you, Victor Javika can take a good punch. Victor Javika can take a good punch. Yeah, let's see. There you go. Big forearm, baby. Come on. Hit him on that big chest, Don Kent. Oh, there's a left from Javika. Both men exchanging punches now. Oh, look at those haymakers. Oh, there's an illegal move by Jovica. See, Jovica wrestle the man. Come on, you barrio Czechoslovakian Puerto Rican street fighter. Very disorientating when you get your eyes raked that way. Well, heck, it just, it, it just continues the whole train of thought. Ooh, there's a low blow. Well, that might be one problem, thinking too much. Right now, Jovica's got an atomic blast coming up. Look at that. Oh, my! Now Kent smashes his head against the turnbuckle. And I tell you, that's a double whopper right there. Well, Jovica here just, nah, there you go. Now Don giving some of his own medicine. Big right hands. Here you go, Don. Give him that neck breaker, baby. Oh! Jovica grabbed the rope. Very slick move by Jovica grabbing the rope. And Don Kent hit himself. Uh-oh, now knee lift. And slowly but surely... Jovica pounding on Kent, taking the advantage. You can actually see, uh-oh, big knee right there by Don Kent. Here it is, baby. One, two, three. One, One. two, three. That's it, baby, oh. isn't it? Oh, oh his foot's on the rope, man. Gee, man. Oh, Don. Turn around, uh -oh. Don. Kent, turn around. He thought he won this match. Now he's rolled up. Two, two, three. There oh. Jovica takes it away from Don Kent. There's your winner. Boy, ladies and gentlemen, I'll tell you something. Joe Vika pulled the trick out of the bag that time. But I'll tell you what, we'll be right back with Wrestling Inquirer for this week. Oh.